Welcome to Help You Sell. You're going to save a lot of money selling your house. That's probably one of the primary reasons you called Help You Sell, and it's something we do very well. Save people money. But let's talk for a moment about how to save the most money. When you list with Help You Sell, you agree to pay our low set fee at closing. That doesn't change no matter how your house sells, whether you find the buyer, we find the buyer, or an outside broker finds the buyer. Of course, if one of our Help You Sell buyer's agents brings the buyer, we do have to compensate them. And if an outside agent brings the buyer, we have to compensate the agent and their office. Don't worry. No matter how the house sells, you're still going to save thousands over what an ordinary broker would have charged you. Now, to save the most, find your own buyer. Okay, I know, that's one of the reasons you hired Help You Sell. You didn't want to be bothered with all that. But I'm not asking you to do a lot. You would be amazed how often a buyer is found simply by taking flyers to your neighbors and talking about the house. They all have family and friends, many of whom might want to live in the neighborhood. The same is true of your place of employment. There you have the additional possibility of people transferring in from out of state. Don't hesitate to talk about your home being for sale especially on social media. If you're active on Facebook or Google+, Twitter, or even LinkedIn, remind people that your house is for sale. Post the pictures, the upcoming open house. Ask your friends to share the listing. Here, let's do a little math. Let's assume you have 100 Facebook friends. Let's assume that each of them has about 50. You ask them all to share your listing with their friends, but only half of them do so. Do you know in that simple sharing, you will have reached 2,600 people? It's remarkable, isn't it? So, what happens if your Facebook friend or your neighbor calls you and says they have somebody who might like to see the house? Well, invite them over and show it to them, and then turn them over to us. We'll discover if they're really interested, and if they are, We'll get them on a purchase agreement and we'll work the sale all the way to closing. You'll save a ton of money and you will have done nothing more than talk the listing up and show the house a couple of times. Now let's go one step further. And remember, you don't have to do any of this. We're just exploring ways to maximize the savings. And one of the best ways to do that is to hold your own open house. Again, let's do the math. Your Help You Sell broker is one person. He or she can only hold one house open at a time. Even if there are a dozen salespeople back in the office, each of them can only hold one house open at a time. But you, you can hold your house open anytime you want. It's not difficult and we'll coach you through it. Everything from safety to signage to staging to getting people to sign in before they come in and showing. And you know the best thing about holding your own open houses? You can do them anytime you want to. Realtors have relegated open houses to weekend afternoons for obvious reasons. But what about that transferee, that out-of-towner who's driving the neighborhood Wednesday afternoon at 3 p.m.? If your house is ready to be shown and you're home, why not put an open house sign out? People put their homes on the market and then find their own buyers all the time. But with ordinary brokers, they don't save a dime. They're still going to pay full fare. At Help You Sell, we play a little differently. If you find your own buyer with us, you're going to pay a whole lot less. And believe it or not, that's what we want. Because the less you pay, the more you save, the more impressed your neighbors and friends are going to be. And that's how we build our business.